Hello Bambinos and welcome back to some more Little Cup action. This is my third game in the speed draft that we're doing against uh, Lucian and his team Rebellion. Um, about to see what he's brought, so let's get it. He didn't want to get swirled, but I don't even know if I'm going to go for Swirlix against him. There's the clink. That's what I'm worried about when it comes to Swirlix. And that's pretty much what I think he's going to lead. So... We can come drop on Sherbert. Um, I guess Puff in the back isn't the worst thing. And then, um, Magnet or Frog Leg? I'm just going to go Magnet, I think. I don't want to go this thing. This thing's fast. But so is Abra. And then with a Tailwind up because of... Yeah, we're doing this for the first game. If if uh, if it doesn't go well, I'm going to go with the Swirlix Strat game too. But I'm pretty sure Clink is definitely coming. Alright, let's get it. I said good luck and have fun solution. And that's exactly what we're gonna do. Clink and Chandler. See there's the clink, that's exactly what was coming for Sorlix. Yeah, I'm just going to Earth Power. I don't want to max this just yet. That might be a mistake. Maybe I should have. Because if he maxes and hits me, he's still going to do a chunk. Because I'm not Eevee Alight on um, Corsola. Yeah, okay. Maybe I should have maxed. Dratini, of course. So there goes the open hand from Gumdrop. Discharge. Okay. Paralyzes himself. <laughs> it's kind of funny. He crit both of us as well though. That's crazy. Oh, and he paralyzed Gumdrop. <laughs> what is going on? And he paralyzed Sherbert. What the hell? 100% paralysis rate? And that was a big chunk. Please don't get fully paralyzed. Please don't get fully paralyzed. He double crit, double powered us. That is, that's crazy. We get the help and Earth power off though. And down goes Clink. That's crazy. Wow, double crit, double para. Okay, that's something we're gonna have to deal with. Obviously, Sherbert cannot take another Wormwind. So, let's just Icy Wind, find out his items. And switch out to Cream Puff. Nice. Hopefully a max room wind now. Come on, max room wind. Yes, let's go. We play the smart switches, boys. Um, I think we just double double gleam. No, that's risky. I 
I think we do. I think we double green. I'm not wasting a max turn here in case he max guards. Citrus or berry juice or whatever. Yep. Okay. Blair, interesting. I don't know if this kills. No. Fry Trimp is in. And I kind of just like rock slide. Gleam again. I don't need to max yet. If I miss my rock slide on Fletchinder, this could be very bad. Uh, Fletchling, sorry. That's why we didn't max. Don't miss, don't miss, please. Okay, down goes Fletchling. He sees that we're Life Orb. This Dratini's like, had it. Abra, okay. Protect here with slurp off. I can't believe that discharge though. Double crit, double para, turn one. I think a scarf as well. Holding out on my max was actually really good here because, um, yeah, this routine is not really a threat anymore. We protect. Shadow Wall, into the Protect, nice, nice, nice. Max Bug. No Sash on the Avro, good to know, good to know. Where is that Sash then? Fire Spin, interesting. Oh, and he missed. I think that's going to be game then. He's paralyzed, he can't do anything. Let's just not reveal anything else. And there we go. No policy on the Jatini either, so I think we're good. That's game one to us. Uh, play with the same rules, yep. What does he do differently here? He's obviously... What does Clink do to make it paralyze everything? Let's have a quick look at Clink. No, there's no item that boosts your secondary effect either, is there? He just got very lucky. Um, do I just do the same? Honestly, do I just do the same? Um, I'm gonna do the same. Cause if it goes badly then game three I go um game three I go for the swirl. 
pretty cool though. I've maxed Swirlix, Corsola, and Anaris now in this uh, little campaign so far. Eviabra, okay. So we saw the Shadow Ball. Um, we don't have Wisp on this thing, so we're going to have to take Shadow Ball, unfortunately. Oh, I've got the tech. Hang on. Do I max guard? Nah, it's never ever going to be enough, is it? I'm going to do it. I think I think Icy Wind, max guard, and then another Icy Wind plus my attack into it should be enough. Oh, he's maxing EV. Okay. Oh, he's G max EV with the attract thing. This could be. I have never heard that. <laughs> that is absolutely ridiculous. I could have just gone for the Swirlix strat. And this boy would have got swirled. I'm definitely going Swirlix game 3. If, if it goes to game 3. Yeah, there's the max guard. You're not shadow boy me, boy. Nice, nice. See, now I can just icy wind again next turn. Because I'll take this hit, because I'm, I'm Eevee Light, I'm Filter. Oh shit, that's powerful. Both of you fall in love, that's, that's crazy. Life Orb, okay. Okay, let's go for this. Please, Mr. Mime Jr. Good lad. Come on in, Corsola. Oh, okay. Abra's still faster and does a chunk. Come on, Corsola. You're faster than Eevee. Abra lives, which is actually annoying. Let's see what Eevee goes for here. Okay, kills Mr. Mine. That's fine. Um, you've got Brick Break. Um, debating whether to go for the more powerful Rockfall, which would set up Sand for Spadef on Anorith, or Quake also does the same thing and doesn't deal with Sand Chip. Let's get ourselves a bit more bulky. Don't miss Dabra. Oh no, that's exactly what I didn't want to happen. That's good damage, though. Is that thing specs? Oh no, I forgot about this as well. Oh, thank you. Thank you for no hacks. Oh, that thing's bulky as hell. It's Anorith, not very effective. Oh wow. You say that? I think mistakes were made maxing um, Corsola here. Oh, 
Oh, missing that rock slide was bad. We've had some bad hacks. Um, right, you're hitting these rock slides, please. Come on, just hit your attacks. Okay, nice. I see you, I see you. Don't miss your rock slides. Oh, or this, or this. Oh, we've had some bad luck, guys. I think this thing is specs. Um, right, yeah, I can't see this going too well. Oh, curse body, and he's if he's if he is specs, he is now struggling. Oh, I wish I had the absorb bulb. I almost went for absorb bulb aqua jet. Oh, I don't have aqua jet either, so I guess I'll shut up. <clears throat> Stab and stronger. And this is Gumi's like scarf. Um Okay, come on then Gleam. Do some big damage. Nope, okay. What's the Gumi got for us here? Ah, nice. It's gonna be tough for Swirlix to clean this one up, I think. Oh, especially with an actually drop. Okay. Depends who it is. If it's Dratini, I think I've got a chance. If it's Clink, we've got no chance. Fletchling, okay. I still think we've got no chance. Um, I have to Gleam Thunderbolt, I think. Yeah, I can't take another one of these, can I? I'll come off it. Ugh. So basically, Fletching has to miss this jawing beat for us to win. Um, we've had some very bad hacks this game. So Lucian takes game two. But my god, that was some bullshit. Um, hmm, okay. Yo, this has been a very haxy set. Double crit, double power, turn one of game one. The rock side miss on Abra was massive, and then the immobilized by love, also massive. Um, I don't think we can kill that thing in one is the problem. Um, do I just go Queen Path? Wait, this is done. Hang on, let me think about this. Do I just go with the Queen Prof? Do I just kill? Mm. I'm going with this. Screw it. If I lose, I lose. But, God, the hacks. Um, yeah. Come on, then. I think he has to go Eevee again, because obviously, hacks him with the immobilization is the way to go. Yeah.
Let's do that. The thing is, the immobilization by love thing is really going to screw me up. And if he hits me with the muddy water, that's going to really screw me up. Hopefully he's gone for the G-Max Cuddle into Swirlix. Oh no, okay. I think I just lost. Okay, that's interesting. <laughs> Ooze isn't going to do too much to us. What do I want to do here? I'm going to swap into my junior to take the dragon type move, I think. Go on, say, say you max dragoned. Please say you max dragoned. Down goes Eevee. <clears throat> oh no, you max guys it into the Anarif, that's fine. That's fine. We got rid of Eevee. I think we need to get rid of the Abra more so than the Gumi. Okay, into my junior. We should take this. Filter, EV light. Nice. So we're having to go for an end game of Ah, oh, we're faster than Gumi after one drop, which is nice. Ooze into the mine junior. Okay. I'm okay with that. Hopefully Swirlix is faster than Abra at minus one. Hmm. I don't know what to do here. Because Abra is a massive threat to... So. I guess I have to. I'm gonna max Star for the Abra. Gumi is plus two. <laughs> so it's gonna do massive amounts of damage to Swirlix, but then I will be weakness policied up and unburdened. But I need to get rid of Abra, or else Swirlix is gonna be on its own. I don't think Swirlix can 1v3 here. Nice. 
nice. That's important for Corsola. That's good damage as well. Sludge Wave. Like I said, a big chunk, but now we're policied up and unburdened. Oh, and Cursed Body, that's amazing. Let's go, Corsola. I feel a lot better about that now because this thing's got Tailwind. Ah, that's actually annoying. I think I protect and Ice Beam the Gumi again. No, no, no. Gumi's never faster than you. I don't need to do that. Even if you Tailwind, you can't. Fletchling isn't sashed, so it's gonna die. And I think Gumi dies. Okay, so as long as Corsa lives this hit, I think we win. Oh my god, was that a crit? No. Oh yeah, he's plus two. But that is the game. We managed to clutch out a 2-1 win over Lucian. And still remain undefeated in Little Cup so far. Three from three. So, uh, GG to Lucian. And uh, come back for our final game of the uh, like group stages, I guess. And I think with three wins out of four, we're, we're pretty much guaranteed playoffs. Um, let's just try and get fourth, the fourth win pretty soon. So uh, thanks for watching. Leave a thumbs up, leave a comment. And uh, if you're not subscribed, subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time. Thank you very much.